Playing Duke is a tremendous opportunity for us to continue to grow as a team. Uh, very tough to get a W here, but there's not one guy in that locker room doesn't believe we can do it. But it's going to be a, it's a difficult challenge. Got a Hall of Fame coach. They have great, great players. And we are going to do everything we can to try to equalize all the, the, the way they play uh, by the way we play. So um, tremendous pressure defense. Oh, um, try, we'll try to create offense out of that when we can. Um, I think it, it starts at the, on the glass. Um, if we can, can block them out and limit their second chance uh, opportunities, I think that'll be huge for us because uh, we're, we're pretty good in transition. Um, we can't let them get any easy buckets. Uh, a lot of mental toughness and just playing within ourselves. Um, you know, last time we played a great Oklahoma team, Blake Griffin. Um, it was pretty close. I thought you know we, we might have had a bail make a run in the second half, but um, just didn't happen for us. We just got to stay strong and stay poised and you know play Michigan basketball. This is one of the games that you uh, that you you know you think about growing up and you see growing up you know on TV. So uh, you know to be here, be about to play the number one seed, you know to go to the Sweet 16 and. No, I don't think it could get any better than this. Just not turning the ball over, Dave, would be huge for us. That, that uh, Just like the Tennessee game, it's just really big that we do not turn the ball over against them. Um, that it, it, It's run out. There's very little defense for the run out transition. And they, get, they change in so quickly. Um, and then just staying out of foul trouble, I think they're very good at drawing fouls. They'll try to get us into fouls. I mean, they will try to get Hardaway and Morgan and Darius Morris in foul trouble immediately, and we have to stay out of that.